My name is Roberto Ferrer. Know me as Rob the Original. I got that name when I when I started doing all the hair art and people started recognizing me. Man, one of the greatest barbers I've ever got my hair cut done by. His designs, man, they're he got them down to perfection. I always was an artist since I was a real little. I went to this local barber shop in the south side of San Antonio uh, called Acapulco Barber Shop. I started uh, working in the shop and I started just looking around. At first I didn't know what I was doing. So I was kind of like learning how to set up, how to put on the cape, you know. I started learning how to do scissor cuts, men's cuts. So I wanted to stand out and do something different. So that's when I decided to do a portrait. And I, I used my little brother as a guinea pig and I was like, look, let me try to do this portrait. You know I know how to draw. Let's see how it comes out. So I, I did a, I got an image of Tupac Shakur and I, I created an image behind his head and I just started doing the negative shading, you know, like it's pretty much like carving, you know, like when I wanted to do my whites, I was carving all the way to the skin and as, as the shades were getting darker, I was leaving the hair longer. So, um, the, you know, the image came out dope, it came out nice. Uh, I got a lot of good feedback after that. So after that, I just started doing portraits. This one day, one of my clients, Christian Rios, he brought to my attention, hey man, why don't we do a video to promote your work? So, you know, we recorded the video, we did a Tony Parker video, uh, MVP. The next morning, Yahoo Sports posted it on their front page. From there, we were getting calls from ESPN, we started getting interviews. The owner of Con Air saw an article on it, and he's like, hey man, get a hold of this guy, I want him on the team. It was a wrap after that, and it's just awesome, you know, it changed my life, it really did. One thing that I, I want to let people know and, and uh, young kids out there, you know, there's always something out there that you're good at. So keep on pushing it. You know, if, if you're good at something, you know, just follow your dream and, you know, it's going to happen, you know, it's possible.